hi viewers uh, welcome to my channel uh, in this video i'm going to show you how to create maven project for spark in intellij so we'll start now to create new project you have to go to file okay new new project so here here you can see lot of options so is if you want to create spt project you have to select scala so now i am going to show how to create maven project because in real time 95 percent will use will create maven projects only sbt is very rare because their uh, dependence manually we need to add and uh, so if if you use maven project it will be uh, easy to uh, integrate with the devops pipeline so you have to select maven option go click on next and uh, you gi give your project name maven Maven project demo same thing artifact ID also you can create you can give same name for first time it will uh, 1.0 version only click on next so project location so I am keeping as it is by default all IntelliJ projects will be available in idea projects folder click on finish this window only so you can see the project structure has been created see source main java so java once you created you have to rename so this is we are not using java as a language right we are using scala project right so ref using refactor you have to rename java with rename java with scala refactor okay test also you can see java that also you can rename now in sb in if you create project uh, spark project using sbt you can see build at sbt here in maven project you will not see build at uh, spt you, you will see pom.xml so here you have to if whatever project name we have given that automatically it came for, for, for first time so whatever modules you want to add that you have to add here in pom.xml so for example first time uh, i want to uh, add spark or spark sql modules right so like this you can uh, you can add dependency tag you have to open and close for example first first uh, for now I'm creating Apache uh, spark SQL so how how to how to know all these things how how from where we will get all these things is maven repository in sbt also in build at sbt you will add right i have demonstrated in my previous video uh, to how to create sbt in the same way so if you see here this is this is the place maven repository there if you want to uh, you have to search with the spark core libraries if you want to you can see here all these if you want in sbt you can see like this right you can add dependency like this right library dependencies uh, this you will copy and paste in maven same way maven these are all xm maven is xml file right it will looks like a xml tags so dependency so what version you are using so currently if you are using uh, spark 3.2.3.4 uh, you can copy as it is so same way you have to copy and paste here okay why this is error okay 
dependency okay 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 we have to uh, something error and first we have to import okay sorry sorry i have to add this tag dependencies these are all dependencies right so we have to open that dependencies tag and we have to close that dependencies now now automatically you, you can see here start downloading all the libraries currently there is no libraries see now it is started downloading you can see all spark related uh, libraries now so similarly all the dependencies currently spark sql i have added if you want uh, scala also you need to add scala type safety okay what are all the required uh, dependencies for your project you can add all okay so all will be downloaded required the packages if you, if you want to go why you want uh, i want this is a scala language i have selected right that's why i given scala i want to import scala library also this is type safety this is required for uh, spark coding and uh, similarly so what are all so these are the main uh, few dependencies i have used and uh, this jcraft everything i uh, jcraft uh, uh, also i will add okay for your uh, spark and scala version what is the relevant version you have to select here that is the only thing you have to do and uh, so once dependency is done we have to in build uh, tag uh, we have to add all these things so for now i am I am copy pasting so but you can use same thing and uh, in few coming videos I will explain what, uh, what is uh, each tag okay for now it will be very helpful you just you copy as it is okay and uh, let me copy this These are all the plugins uh, uh, I'm go uh, I have added here. So in build tag, so what is the source directory? All our code will be available in source main scala, right? So the I have given there. This is a Maven plugin, and uh, and main important thing is uh, and uh, uh, Maven Surefire plugin. This I will explain later. So um, shaded plugin and the face uh, uh, package i have given so and this is a main class this is the important main class we need to implement in a manifest tag so main class uh, whatever main function is there which whichever uh, all the code will be in the spark projects now how spark projects will be designed in maven uh, project is um, all the pro uh, all the business logic will be developed and in different different packages and without main class in main method in uh, one more package will create as a main there uh, main method will be uh, all other classes will be called in main method that main method name we need to mention that package name or that that main method name we need to use here okay so currently uh, i have not given uh, so we have to create so whatever name you are going to call that scala class so i will give as a mm, uh, sorry sorry 
this should be package right main main so here main method will be there right this time uh, printing maven project okay so i have given like this for that pom.xml so all dependence has been uh, downloaded so once you created maven dependency so here right side you can see maven project so you have to open okay life cycle so these are all the all the life cycle uh, options okay clean um, mainly you will use only we will use clean to clean the existing jar file okay install to uh, generate the jar file okay for currently uh, i will clean this you can see uh, clean means so these are all the uh, in sbt i have explained right uh, sbt commands uh, clean and install clean what will do what it will do it will remove the it will clean the target directory okay i mean it will clean the existing jar file so if you click on uh, install it will create new jar files okay i have clicked on install now we'll see currently there is no target folder right once i click on install you can see target folder so install all the uh, now this is started okay building jar file is started it is downloading required uh, packages to build jar file and uh, if you uh, uh, these are all warnings yellow color you can ignore if red color come that is error that you have to fix is downloading downloading it is still creating the so in the real time also so whenever uh, you, you you can clone that uh, uh, already spark project maven project will be there okay you have to clone to in uh, uh, into in uh, intellij and what you have to do so you have to add your your code and you have to clean you have to uh, uh, generate jar file and you have to test in uh, edge node okay then only you have to move to other environments like qa uat like this so now build success uh, so now you can see target folder has been created in the target folder you can see demo uh, jar file okay so once jar file is there uh, i in my previous videos i have shown how to uh, call the uh, spark uh, how to uh, call the spark submit using jar file okay so jar has been created so where you can see jar documents or my computer or else documents home uh, idea projects right it has been uh, idea projects uh, see maven demo so target folder has been created and this is a jar file jar file has been created using this jar you can call our whatever function you have created in that uh, sparse uh, function okay this is the this is the way you can use same way same file uh, same code whatever i have shown here okay so um, use uh, you can use same code same plugin and uh, you try okay so if uh, if you want to this uh, show uh, you can 
message me or give me your uh, email ids in the comment section so that if you want i can export this project i can give you directly you can create programs and so directly in real time also clean install clean it will uh, clean the so currently uh, see you can see uh, jar file is there right if i click on double click on clean clean what it will do it will uh, remove the jar file old jar file see now jar file is gone like that if you in real time once uh, so whenever you want new changes you can clean that jar file so you add your whatever code logic business logic you want then you can create jar and you can test so this is the uh, okay these are all the maven plugins will be available in this uh, maven repository okay maven repo you just go here and search whatever you want okay thanks for watching this video in next video i will be demonstrating how to uh, actually uh, create different different classes how to create project structure okay